The transform copy tool allows you to use the drag rectangle to select an area to be copied and then pasted back onto the mesh or texture map that we have to be working on. So I like this bullet hole right here and I'm going to click and drag around it. And now I've copied every layer that, um, that is visible because I did copy visible layers over here in the tool options panel. Now I can move this around and paste it somewhere else. Now let's take a look at this option right here. If we had ticked erase old position, that would have erased that bullet hole right there and anything in that, uh, that square selection. And before we paste it, we also have another option here called paste merged. And what that will do is merge everything down from every layer that we've copied into whatever layer it is we happen to be pasting it into. We can also transform this by dragging out these nodes. And let's just keep it a rectangle. And we'll pop that right over here. So to apply it, we just hit enter on the keyboard. And you see it pasted there. It only grabbed the color because I have depth and spec hidden. So let's deactivate the tool real quick and reactivate it. Let's turn on uh, depth and then we'll grab that again. So now we should have depth as well as color. Yes. And we can scale that up, make it a little bit bigger. Enter again and place it in a couple different spots. We can even just rotate it and scale it like so. Get a little more interesting results. You can also, in the tool options panel, export this out to PSD, which we won't be doing. You can also import a PSD. You can also edit it directly in Photoshop. And uh, you can also save and load these directly inside of Photoshop, uh, sorry, not Photoshop, the 3D Codes presets.